Greetings and salutations, my operators, and welcome back to Mega Man X Dive. Is the server? Is the final raid, maybe. It's the last raid for Hell Sigma, at least. Uh, I don't remember if there's actually is another one after this. There is still a month and a bit left, so maybe we might be in, like, Wolf Sigma again, but... Yeah, this should be the last Hell Sigma raid, at least. Uh, I'm trying out something new. I'm trying to put the controller on the screen. Not sure how well it shows up. And I'm using an Xbox controller, which uh, is mainly just because I'm lazy. Unplug it and plug it back in. Plug it back in my uh, PS3 controller. All right. Is it even lighting up properly? That is moving. I think. Oh, righty, righty, right. So, I think I need to, like, reset, like, a lot of the uh, button mapping. Because I'm pretty sure it's all still set to, like, uh, what I had my PS3 for. So, I'm just going to do, like, all the daily stuff first, get, like, reacquainted with the controls. But yeah, uh, for those who don't remember, uh, Hell Sigma is the easiest of the raids because he doesn't move, and he is very close to the ground. So the goal is to get all ten slots at max max point point value, which is thirty mil. I got seven this morning before I ran out ran out of time. Got that work to do. <laughs> And I screwed up with my uh, next uh, next armor. Who he did okay. He's not like fully built up yet. He probably never will be because I don't have the resources to do it anymore. It's honestly probably better for me to like get ten percent for overall bonus damage than just to focus on one character at this point. Which would be 20 star ranks? And the problem is I don't have enough points. Or patches. Oh yeah, at some point I became the guild master of this, uh, of Shower Rock. Because, uh, he was like waffling long before the the guillotine fell, so to speak. So, yeah. So it's pretty much just me in this guild. And a couple of newbies. I don't think anyone else is like super dedicated to the guild bosses I am. Oh, we're hitting 25 though. Yeah, everyone's hitting like 100k. Yeah. Uh, I messed up my setup for next dive. And I don't really think I'm going to use them either. I really do not like charge characters. Everyone else did pretty well, though. I don't know how people play Gangsta Sigma. I'm, like, always, like, struggling. I just don't understand how. Like, I don't know what the cycle is for it. Like, uh, Dive Armor Zero had... 10 seconds left before I ran out of time. Iris had 30 seconds, I think. Rico had like 30 seconds. Via had 5 somehow. Uh, Shadow Armor had like a minute. <laughs> uh, AL had like literally 2 seconds left before I ran out of time. Pandora, same thing. Yeah, next armor, really, I was not good at him. But yeah, first things first. Let me just quickly get the dead out of the way. We'll do a quick co-op before... Or not co-op. Oh, we'll do a challenge elevator run. Let's get a good idea of how... Uh, what the button maps is. If it's the same. Because there's been a couple of times where my button mapping like just recessed because I unplugged it my controller. And that's like super annoying. Uh, 
Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I don't know who I would. I might use Gore Eco, but I don't think she has like enough damage boosters. I think I know her DNA's. I gotta double check her. Okay, so that works. Jump still works. That's still attack. That's still. Okay. Okay, that's still dash. Okay, everything looks good. It feels a little weird though because of uh, the button maps aren't flat like the my PS3 controllers. Like I, I don't like the triggers. They're too large. Alright. Ah, Danny area. Okay, this would be a good, like, gauge on how well I do. Where the hell are my... Where are my good swords? What the... What is the order of this? I am, like, so baffled by what the order was. Yeah, it feels weird, man. I feel like the shoulder buttons aren't as responsive as my PS3 controller. Which, or my joystick, what the hell? Yeah, it's gonna be weird. You know, when offline comes out, I might do speed runs. Like, or time attacks, I guess. I don't know, I always had fun with these. Ah, uh, that's pretty bad. I would need to figure out, like, a whole different setup, though. Four seconds faster than me. God damn it. Uh, I should... I gotta stop dashing in the air. It takes up so much time. Ah, screw it up. Screw up. Okay, and then that turret spawns and they all come on. Okay. And down. Come on. Okay, he spawns and this one spawns and then we he attack. I'm not I'm not having the boost. On low enough. Okay, we'll pop that. Wait for these to spawn. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. 
Damn it. Same time. Oh, technically, like, 30 milliseconds faster. Oof. I'm just so bad at that one. Keep dashing the air like an idiot. Alright, let's see if we can get a PvP match in. Oh, people are actually online today. Oh, I'm still dead. I'm just dead here. Yeah, I just don't get it. Every time like I face someone with like, a shield, it takes me forever to break through it. But when I have a shield with the same character, they just melt me like butter. That's okay. I'm guessing this guy's farming gallery points. Or he took pity on me. Okay. Oh, wait. Free capsule, right? Get those sweet, sweet patches, which I desperately need. I still find it really weird that uh, the Mega Man team isn't allowed to use the crossover characters. Like, it's still Capcom. <laughs> I don't know why it's like Weird uh, company politics going on when it's the same company. <laughs> All right, so do I have DNAs on Eco? I do not, but I have triple slow and a heal. And she has boss kill too. She's like really good for raids, technically. Hopefully, probably, maybe not. Wow, she has plus 20% of damage. Uh... Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna do it. Okay, how many do you need? 50... Uh, I don't need this one. 50, so I need 90. And then, rolling these ones. Which I think is like, 16. Oh wait, I can't buy... Because he's a crossover character, I forgot! Oh no! Ah, so I have actually used passes for. Ooh, I hope not enough. Oh god, where is it? Where is she? Okay, and then the 40. And then the 60. I want to say. Alright. Fingers crossed to get something good. Because, my god, I have been failing these rolls so badly on my own. Alright, continuous damage. Good. That's good. Crit damage. Not good. Come on. That's bad. Immobilize 3, that's uh, usable at least. 
Flare kill, really? We're, we're going to do that? We're going, we're going to do that? Oh, uh, what's her what's her special? Oh, she has all repair too. Yeah, I want short range boost or boss killer. Uh God, how much should I spend on her? Go for the 16. Come on. Better. I don't think it really works that well. Come on. That's bad. Come on. That's worse. Holy moly. Okay, we're doing this now. Okay, I do six more rolls. Three on slot two and three on slot uh, three on slot two and three on slot uh, three. Come on, give me the attacker stats. Fine, that's passable, I guess. Wow. I really hate how common immobilizer is. But at least that's usable. Hopefully. Boss go two! Alright. Yes! Yes! You're in three, baby! Do I... Do I have anything that actually inflicts immobilize on her? I can do continuous damage. But I don't think I actually have anything that can do immobilize naturally. <laughs> Uh, slow start down, slow down, become the mobile. I think she can immobilize. Let's do a quick check on that. If she can mobilize, both. Well, I right, I won't reroll for her. Uh, I need like a bulky single target. Someone who has like a stat bar. <laughs> そんなのもちろん決まってるでしょ。Okay, good. She can move We are golden. Thank God. Okay, so she's gonna be like heavily burst damage. Okay, so the next character I wanna work on is Christmas Eco. Cause... This gives plus 10% attack. That's pretty much it though. All right, her DNA's RC aren't that good for what I use her for. So she's the only thing she has is long reach boost. Uh, we'll we'll see, we'll see. Okay, let's get raiding. Okay, get the good stuff out of the way first. Oh, wait, I gotta figure out what the heck is going on with my 
sort. It is my favorite. Because it seems so weird, I don't know why. Alright, and this gives us double melee for a grand total of that's 18 plus 6. 24! Anyways. Alright. Let's see how bad they do. Yeah, set them up first. God, the controller feels so weird. I do not think I'm going to be doing well. Like, I feel so much more delayed than my PS3 controller. Try switching dash to my trigger, I guess. Okay, yes. Why am I not dashing? I'm pressing the button. Am I like overloading the inputs? I'm so confused. Like, I'm doing like, so much worse. This is insane. Like, thank god ours has the bonus damage, but why is this feeling so weird? It does take me for a die, though. Like, I cannot do this using the 360 controller. Like, that felt so delayed. I don't get why. Like, is it because my input's being fed to the display? That'd be bad. Okay. Hmm. Like, I don't want to switch it to the face button.
Okay, this does slow, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's so weird. Okay, so one thing I learned while fighting uh, Health Open this morning is that he is too high for the uh, Mega Scorpio chip if you do on the ground. Like, those are just nothing. God, there's so much bounce in these stupid controllers. Oh, why did I decide to do this? I make my I made the easiest raid like the hardest thing for me. Okay, do five million. Seventeen seconds. I honestly don't know. Uh, I'm getting no crits here. Uh, that's king. Okay, I'm gonna switch it back. The bounce on the triggers is insane. Man, I am so conflicted. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. Oh god. How do people play with the thing? Well, I guess it's not meant for that. It's meant for guns. For FPSs. But like almost every FPS I ever default controls for FPSs. It's never been the triggers, it's been like the top on the The bumpers. So that doesn't make sense either. I'm trying to keep like an eye out on the the recharge bar for Mega Scorpio. Because that's like a large chunk of my damage. Oh, it's hard to see that I could like keep uh, switching skills. Okay, 
Oh, we're halfway there at the mid mark. We might make it. Always so shaky. Yes! Oh god, I, I just don't get why I'm so bad playing Hell Sigma or playing Sigma again, Gerald. I should not have that much trouble with him. Everyone else, like, freaking maxes out, like, immediately. Like, I don't know what the build is. <sighs> yeah, I'm angry at myself for not knowing it. Okay. So next we have Dark Room Zero. And I think even the Berserker Great Sword, and I did not favor it. I think this was the Berserker Great Sword combined with the what you call it. Multicar. Boomerang Blade. Also has Rep Reload, so we're good there. My Buster Melee Weapon build. Doesn't have the DNA codes, but he has plus 4% anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Man, his DNA is actually like give him an like, insane boost. I uh, mean, I should just unlock them at least, because that gives like a flat thirty. So I don't even need to use the boomerang blade to max out quickly, and get safe for someone else. SD, where is Dive Armors? Did I miss it? Is that top? There he is. I didn't miss it. So, 50, 40, and the 16 for the DNAs. DNAs aren't, like, that big a deal for him. In my opinion. That's horrible. Getting worse. Oh my god! Seriously? Hey, short range booze! Which I think already have. Yeah. So. That sucks. Oh, at least I got a bus color. So, yeah, not really the most ideal setup for him. <laughs> I 
Do these have like any other abilities? I actually don't know. Is that slow? Is that dash slash, which is yeah. Not really. I don't think any of them have like a defense down other than the uh Scanner Saber. Hmm. Yeah, this is always like more of a PvP weapon. So I guess Arbor is like the best option for a dual melee. I don't think the Muramasa or a Demon Blade. All right, have the random knocking down target that I don't know what hers. I think split mushroom still glitch, so I think that actually might be like the most maximum damage you can do. Okay, so pure melee build. Let's go. Man, his cooldowns for a slash tax actually look really long. I feel like I'm missing something here. We're at 10 mil within like 20 seconds, so he should be good. You know, I never bought a look, but is there a way to change the UI to actually show the the chip skill? Because it's never been relevant until like raids. Man, he is just. Melting through them like butter. I meant it would take like the full two minutes if you didn't have the four point boost. And we're done. But seriously, is there a way to change the UI? Not really. Yeah, the UI changes are only allowed on mobile, I guess. Just kill me! Man, after all the BS that was the last several Sigma raids, I'm glad that Hell Sigma is so easy. And it's purely just a, da uh, a damage check. <laughs> because 
all the others were so RNG heavy. It was insane. Insane. What weapon that stuff that you prefer? Ancient relic and the fucking ballista. Honestly, it's probably not her best setup, but kind of just trying to ram ideas. Honestly. Because I want the crit from a machine gun while not doing horrible damage. That was the logic. I'm still kind of iffy on the Via chip. Because it gives 4% damage. Versus... Oh god, I really wish it, it would chill like the time. Uh, the reload of a thousand. So that's one second? So you're having 4% damage the entire fight. Versus Mega Scorpio. Which is every 12 seconds. For... I don't remember how long it lasts, but it lasts for a while. Which is only an additional 7%. I think it lasts for about 6 seconds. So I think on paper, Via does give you more damage. But, yeah. Luckily, Ale does not da does enough damage on her own that doesn't really make that big a difference. Oh, music's dead again. Oh, I forgot to do the thing! Uh, I lost all the damage. I have like a 20% crit rate, I guess. It's not great, but you know, it's better than nothing, I guess. I probably should be like cycling my weapons. Okay, I've done six. Oh, I'm do I was not paying attention. Whoops, was bothering. I fat finger that one. Amazing, like how high her damage is. Honestly, it's insane. Like, she's doing he maxed out with like a very subpar skill set, or not skill set, a weapon layout. It's so hard to die in this raid. Yeah, save nine seconds. That's horrifying. All right. And then I did Via and Celebration Rico. 
Let's do Via first, because they actually had like a hard time maxing out one. Man, it's kinda it's kinda suck to lose this weapon combo. Or card combo in the offline version. Cause it's like one of the highest damage dealing sets. I think the other one is the Dragon in our Andromeda from Star Force. Because I think only those two have a double attack up along with the uh, double attack up along with uh, compatible cards that have additional attack up. Keep that figure that pause button. All right, halfway there, so under a minute. We should be good. We should be done. 10 seconds to spare, I think. Dude, I don't remember the rage shaking this much. <laughs> Like, is it exclusive to, like, the larger raids? Or have I just not been, like, paying attention? Anyway, I still have, I still have fun with this. Even though, like, this throws my hands. I don't know why. It's like, Unga Bunga really makes me happy. Just pump me up for the dopamine. This sounds so wrong. Okay. Alright, that's the first five down. And they have Tau and Pandora, Subration Eco. I should try out uh, Gore Eco first. Just see how her damage is. Gore Eco is where? I still have shower armor too, so we already have three slots. Three slots ready to go. I do want to try out Christmas Eco as well. What was so special about Evil Eye? I thought it's a high ranking. Oh, because it has boss color and hail bolts. I don't know what the cycle is though. I'm not sure if you use the ball one and then switch over. Or what? Yeah, okay. Uh, don't have source of slow. No, wait, eco, core eco is a source of slow. Okay, yeah, I should be able to trigger all my, uh, buffs. God, it looks like this is terribly quiet every time. 
ってて、あっち行ってて、退屈ね。退屈ね、あっち行ってて、あっち行ってて。退屈ね。あっち行ってて、あっち行ってて、退屈ね。Not really crying as much as I want. Oh, I got a jump when I attack. I'm lucky losing up a lot of damage. I don't think it can. Wait, her, her shot should be able to penetrate terrain, though. But it didn't look like it hit the damage. That's weird. Six mil after 30 seconds. That's pretty bad. Okay, now it's, it's doing damage. It this didn't seem like it. Uh, uh, I'm not liking this. I'm, it's 40 seconds. I'm only at 13. Not enough. Either bad weapon or. Uh, not enough bonus damage. What about bit? So the game enhanced attack when you get hit. I might not be getting hit enough. Uh, I'm still kind of iffy. Maybe the sick machine gun will do more. Because it will give me poison dots. I could go like completely off the rails and like use a sprayer. I right, would have to find the cards for that. And that's the challenge. Whew. Man, it's already been an hour. I'm gone for a second. Okay, rest. Three mil at the first. Thirty seconds. Six mil. Thirty seconds. Uh. I really feel like I'm doing my cycles wrong. Can I get there? It's gonna be tight. Oh, 
I don't think I do five, five mil in ten seconds. Oh, maybe. Oh, so close. I think I can do it, but it's gonna be tight. Ooh. Okay, yeah, that's. I think that's proper cycle. I have to. I can't do a quick switch. I have to actually unload the machine gun on it. I'm losing too much time on like half spins. Which everyone advised me that I should be quick switching, but it really does seem like the half spin does not do enough. I did miss out on some skill triggers though, so that might be the big reason. Man, I'm just like not critting. Wow, seriously. I have no idea if the uh, ball stacks are actually working. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna make it. I don't think I'm gonna make it. I think I had some good luck crits last time, and it's just not happening this time. Twenty eight again. Just just a little under, so annoying. やってしまったのね。こうなったらもう好きにさせてもらうわ。ああ、退屈ね。ああ。ああ、やっぱりデイリーリロールフォーです。ああ、ゲスアイディアリーリロールフォーです。ああ、退屈ね。ああ、退
I hate how frugal I have to be with this. Uh, couldn't be level two. Gotta do three at a time. And if there's extra, I guess I just cry. That was bad. Hey, that's actually really good. Uh, yeah. Yeah, nothing stuffed on anyone else's toes. Uh, yeah, this seems good. I mean, yes, boss color is stepping on toes. Because you have boss color. So technically, that's uh, being wasted. So I guess I can try a for this one. Nope! Keep boss color. Alright. But at least now we have a guaranteed 14% additional damage. And that should hopefully push us over the edge to like calmly get to uh, uh 30 mil. I just can't miss the attackers. It'd be nice if that also hit, because that's like nice additional damage. We're technically one mil up from before. Thanks. I don't know if that like lingering ball hits him when I'm on the ground, so I should try to do that when I'm in the air. That might be additional damage that I'm missing. Or it's like a weird residual effect. Yeah, it does not seem to be the case. Oh, I might only appear when I'm in frenzy, that's why. So I guess it's disconnected at some point. Ah, it's left. Wow, we are making way better time. It's amazing what additional 14% do. Although you have to wonder if that extra... Uh, those extra attempts on rolling on her would have been better just like... Bent on like additional stars for other characters. I can't even die. Ugh. Eight seconds remaining. Woo. All right, that's another in the thirty mil club. So after that, the Pandora, Shao Armor, and Celebration Rico. Just trying to figure out like what weapons are not being used right now.
やってしまったのねこうなったらジロジロ見ないで何よ Like, I should probably reroll for her. At least for one, two, and one, two, and four. I don't think her four has any, like, insane good stuff. Yeah, her. Her s l u e skill is just crit damage echo. Which is not great. Okay, let's get this. At minimum. So I'll be 40 and then plus the 16. Yeah, just a 10% damage. Always nice. Let's try to reroll these two. That's bad. Come on, that's a question, my bear. Can she inflict no, no weapon now I think about it? I want to say yes, but I actually don't know. <laughs> She can flick a mobile. I don't think she can do no weapon. So I would have to give her a skill that does it. Do I get enhanced damage and then movement speed? She's all buffed. So yeah, she has nothing for no weapon, so I should get rid of that skill as well. Uh. Are you kidding me? Oh、uh, no. No, 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 no. Wow. Oh, her D needs to complete revamp. This sucks. Long range weasel did not help us. I mean, technically, it's better than no weapon. Because they're both doing nothing. So I might as well take it, I guess. That's bad. That's worse. Are you kidding me? Seriously? No weapon again? Am I just cycling through the same ones? Oh, game, why? Why? Not like this. <laughs> Not like this. Better, Ashley. Because I'm going to be full health the entire time. Wait, is there a prep amp the same amount, really? Oh, it goes up by one, that's why. So, at level 1, it's the same amount as all the other ones, but at level 2, it starts falling off. So, like, I should roll for that then? Okay, okay that's fine. Or, skill 1's fine. I still need skill 2 and 3 for optimum gameplay. God, how much money am I willing to spend, though? That is the question. <laughs> that I do not know the answer to. I guess get to level 2 first. Nope. Hey! Gun 2! Alright, let's get to level 3. 
Yeah, I mean, technically it's currently better because now it's not stepping on other toes. Definitely not. Never that again. Let's get 14, I guess. 14 is 420. Ugh. Freaking resistances. Wow. Man, they really waited no weapon up. Oh my god, seriously? Hell, may I almost as well use. We've gone past a thousand. Yeah, I'm not happy about that. Wow. Please, just give me continuous damage three. Wait, what? Oh my god, I'm actually out. Well. I guess we're done that. Hey, we actually got the good one. Nice. All right, so not the most optimal setup, but it's usable at least. I did not expect me to actually run out of DNA points though. Zero zero, me Oh, I have a launcher set up. Let's get rid of melee. I have enough, I have enough stores to go around. The old classic. Christ, get rid of... Hmm. That's actually a good question. Get rid of split mushroom, but then I have to use the Doom Blade to jump up. Uh, continuous 40 damage. Use my double melee setup. Alright, fingers crossed, we get that 30 mil easy. I don't know what counts as long range. I think it has to be like across the screen. I don't understand why that counts or why that spawned up there. Ah, oh, god damn it, hit the freaking slime behind me. Who's in my deeps? Oh, I'm not actually. I don't think that lower blade is hitting. But I actually might need to jump up in order to, like, ultimately do this. Oh, we have 17 mil, 40 seconds left. I don't... Zero 
Uh, can I make it? It's close. I think if I had different weapons set up. I think my reindeer already does defense down. Or not. Uh, that's healing stuff. Crit damage. Elk will come in mobile. We're gonna shield stuff. So I don't do defense down, which kinda sucks. So I do need the sword. Hmm. Could go for military buster. Okay, this gives me six. Sixteen. Twenty-four versus Yeah, same amount of damage. Oh wait, no, this is eight. So I get two percent more. And military buster does give me crit, technically. Yeah, but she doesn't need crit. She has plenty of crit on her own. She needs defense down. Which I think I should bring the more clone this then. Yeah, I think we can go split mushroom. It's curious every four seconds. The heart the heart damage every four seconds. Alright. Let's try this one. Alright. Can't get there before the reindeer does. I don't think I'm doing enough. I am technically doing like the wrong sequence because I you am losing my uh boxes beforehand. Uh, 10 mil out of the mark. Am I doing worse? I have the via chip on the mock bonus, so I should still be benefiting from the additional damage. 
Oh my god, we're only at 16 at 30 seconds left. Am I not hitting with the mock bonus? That's what I'm kind of wondering at this point. Like, that's really bad. That went really poorly. Like, I see the ability to get to, uh, what you call it, 30 mil. But it just doesn't seem to be happening. Okay, let me just do, like, one quick experiment first. I just want to see if the... And, you know, I could have done that when I had 30 seconds left. That's my bad. Well! I think he's got the presents. I am trying my hardest to, like, look at the whole screen while looking at my cooldown bars. Maybe I should have done this the other way. Uh, 12 uh, minute mark. Uh, it's questionable. I really don't understand why that popped up there. I screw up the cycle. I am doing so much worse now. Oh wait, I didn't jump. That's why. I'm actually losing damage. That was stupid. I forgot about how I tried to split mushroom on. So basically, I lost off 4% of damage. So I definitely should switch that. So Nightmare should be main, main attacker. Alright, let's try it again, Frank. Zero zero 
I am not great enough. Ah, uh, I screwed up my cycle. Damn, you muscle memory. Yeah, I'm still quiet. I'm still come, 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 from down here. I don't need jump at all. Man, I think it takes forever to recharge, huh? Oh boy, that's gonna be hard to re replicate, like, for next week. Oh, can I break the top 10? <laughs> Wait, it's still three left? Who don't have I done? I thought I had two left. Pand oh, Pandora, Shao Armor, and then Celebration Rico. Uh, do Celebration Rico last because she has like the most leeway. Cause she just obliterates. Oh, so, let's see how armor honestly. So let's do Pandora. She was a little harder to use. Just, just because of how the ammo cycle went. See, so, yeah, I'm going with uh, zero distance, or the gangster card. What's it called? Fighting is justice for zero distance and double amp. Hopefully we're close enough to count. And then two of the Doctor or Professor Galdi for spur amp two and spur amp three. And I don't think her DNAs really matter much other than the main ones. Uh, oh no, I do have crit damage enhancement resonance. That's a really important one for her. Melee amps sadly wasted on her. Got the boss killers on her. Got immobilized because why not? Because everyone had freaking immobilized for some reason. Yeah, I really wanted to swap those for uh, short range, but nope, only got one. Sadly, her DNAs in two and three are two and four are pretty bad. It all PvP based, basically. So you aren't really getting much. So two is always gonna be like a dead slot.
Uh, that is it. Let's get rolling. Thankfully, she's the easiest one. I actually don't need a dash at all. I can just press like two buttons. <laughs> just gonna get her uh, kill cycle probably. <laughs> There's a problem where uh, she'll hit the slimes like that. So you do miss out on a lot of damage that way. But I don't really think there's a easy way to solve that for her. She doesn't have an AoE like everyone else. So it's just like an unfortunate circumstance for her. I really don't know if it's like close enough forward your distance. You have to use her uh, shield right away in order to get the cycle for her invisibility properly. Because her invisibility only lasts as long as the cooldown of the skill itself when you know you fire off the fire off the spears. So if you don't fire them off and just keep them, you don't get like a shield. You just have three spears that do more constant damage. But then you're also uh, just taking more damage. Or not taking more damage. You're not healing as often. Because the cooldown for the the spears and the invincibility are, and the heal are like all the same. So they're pretty good in here. I really gotta stop pulling, putting my controller right, right in front of the mic. It's the ASMR no one wants. Yeah, see that I lost the cycle there. Like I am not doing enough, which is weird because I, I think I'm not critting often enough. Yeah, I think I missed some cycles there. I like might just barely get in the one second, but I'm not taking that risk. Yeah, I have to use my skills as soon as they're available. Because I think that was where most of her damage is coming from. So if I don't keep track of her skills, I'm losing out on like very huge amounts of damage. And even then, it's like a very tight squeeze for her to like get to 30 mil. Okay, we're at 10 mil after 40 seconds. Uh, I think we're okay. Which kind of which we were higher. There's not much I can do here. Oh, you know, what? I could change my control layout. If I if this fails again, I'll change my control layout. So I can use my uh the trigger. And just hold down the trigger instead. Because I'm losing out on time whenever I has switch use my skills. Because I'm taking my hands off the uh what do you call it? 
The attack one. I think we're fine. I think 40 seconds, that point out 40 seconds remaining is a good indicator that we're gonna hit cap. Okay, we're at 25. We still have 20 seconds. We're good. I think we're good. Yeah, I think I just missed some damage cycles. Or skill cycles. Oh, one second remaining. Ooh, I got careless in the last couple seconds there. I... I slipped. <laughs> that was a close one. I am like really struggling for someone who has a hundred and eighty percent bonus damage. Is there fact like a lot of people can cap at like a hundred? Apparently. And I don't really know why. Like, my DNAs aren't that bad. <laughs> I think it's the card setup that I just haven't noticed that gives way more damage than what I'm using. That's a possibility, I guess. But I'm like. 95% sure, like, I have, like, the maximum amount of damage possible <laughs> for a car setup for most of them. Man, I really did not need to save the Arc Cracker for Shadow Armor. That could have been used for someone else for, like, an easier run. <laughs> That is a 20%. Oof. I'll give him the model clonus and see how he does. Does Shao Armor have Buster bonus? Now I think about it. He has the focus. Oh, he does have Buster Amp, so I should use Busters. Does he even do the focus? I think that's the thing he doesn't do, and I just have a lot of it. <laughs> oh, no, Gig Attack does the focus. Okay, yeah, we're good. So he can do everything. He can do all his conditions. Uh, switch out. The via on Red Lotus then for Mega Scorpio, I guess. Because Red Lotus does continuous damage along with what you call it Defense Down. So it should be a good build. Even if, even if this was like suboptimal, I'm pretty sure I still have like at least 10 seconds before the timer runs out. Cause that's also that's just how nuts he is. It's the same situation where I have to keep my eye on the uh, skill tracker. Because it is the most most of the damage. But also his cooldowns like super fast. Cause we just did like 12 mil within 20 seconds. 
He just can't be stopped. I thought we were gonna capture for like 30 seconds enough. I should try Ferrum. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try Ferrum. Uh, not for, uh, like an Astro run, because I'm still gonna do, like, uh, Rico. Because she's just nudge. Okay, now I can test out the Meg Scorpio. That is so weird. Just waiting for Mega Scorpio to recharge. I don't get why it spawns up there. I just want to see it spawn on the bottom. Okay, I'll hit you. There. Now I can't tell because he's on fire. God damn it. This experiment sucks. Come on. Okay. This is not an ideal test environment. Yeah, I'm gonna try Ferrum. Maybe I'll try Superbase, see how he does. Cause I see a lot of people like maxing out Ferrum. See how how high she can get. Oh my god, we're in top ten right now. I mean, sure, like just like less than the higher people are actually running the raids, but still being out hundred people. I don't know what she's running. Yeah, <laughs> they mobilize. Uh, it makes me sweat. Zero distance boost, short range boost. Okay, that's overlapping, so that's dead. Boss color. Uh, you know what? I, she's, she's not ideal right now. She has a shit ton of crit, though. But she is losing out on a lot of damage because a lot of her skills just kind of overlap. I don't even know what to run for. I guess I would give her the Arc Cracker. And the Sinister Shadow. Just keep her alive, cause I've always had tr uh, trouble keeping her alive. Like her shield dissolves very quickly. And I'm not like entirely sure why. Ready? Yeah, we're not getting like super high damage here. We're only at three mil after ten seconds. Although this is not like an ideal setup either, honestly. This is a very defensive setup.
Maybe he would benefit from more, like, heavier attacks, I guess? Yeah, we're just barely hitting 10 mil at the one minute mark. At best, she's getting... Uh, she's getting 20. Maybe 25. Yeah, it looks like we're only gonna be hate going. <laughs> Surprisingly, it's like, like an actual bigger deal that the Sinister Shadow does not deplete all of its uh weapon energy. Yeah. Her DNA is too crummy. She would need like a full, fully, uh, planned out one. I love her aren't even triggering. So she's doing out like a shit ton of damage. Right, same as all like entirely defensive. Like her buffs are interesting because they're all random. I think she has potential to like max out. She also has defense down by default. That's always nice. Go for pure buster. That gives us 10, 18, 26. His DNAs are. Buster have one, two. Defense down one. Defense down three. Defense down three. So that's sadly uh, a loss. Although, I don't think I can do continuous special damage. I usually rely on the sub-boss effect for that. So, we're losing out on 4 to 10. Lo losing out 18% right now. So, that guy sucks. Because I don't think... I have a buster that... No, I have a shooting dragon. Along with the chemical buster. This also does have bo uh, boss killer, so... Not terrible. I don't think I need slow... Technically, this is two fast busters. I'm pretty sure both of these have like the, the fire rate of a machine gun as well. Alright, let's try it. So this is like a semi-optimal build for super base. I don't know if he can hit Sigma from down here. I really don't know what where the hit. All right, cool.
I don't know if I can out-heal the damage, honestly. I hope I can. Ah, oh, not the waste. I think I can out-heal him. If I can't, well... I need to actually start playing and not just unga my way through this. But we're only at 7 mil. We're not getting enough crits. Uh, one minute in and already, or only at one mil, or ten mil, or twelve mil. I think I'm losing out damage by not hitting him with the bomb laser. Whereas other raid bosses, you would be able to hit it, so you get like a double tap. Or I guess double dipping would be more appropriate there. But yeah, since you can't hit him with the bomb later because he's, you know, out of bounds. I guess this might be the best that he can do. Yeah, this is not the ideal cycle for him. He probably could get 30 if I use... If I do it one at a time, maybe? Like, unload all of Ultimate Blast, switch to Biochemical, wait for Ultimate Blast to come back online, and then switch back. Like, that might be able to do it for him. But, yeah, it's kind of hard to tell for me to tell right now. I don't think I want to dedicate that much time to it. <laughs> yeah, all my other characters don't have enough DNAs to, like, really attempt it. Oh, actually. That might be a lie. Okay, cause burn. Double the slash attack, I guess. Cause slow. And a shield. I think I want the shield rather than slow. I actually, he has like actually has like really good DNA's on him right now. It's like super optimal. Uh, didn't get good DNA's though. I don't think I can connect anyone because I need points still. Yeah, I can't connect anyone right now. But in theory, S class hunter zero should be actually really good. Yeah, might as well try. I think he needs double melee weapons. I'm pretty sure he just has regular melee expert. Yeah, he only needs one. Alright, let's try this. Oh, I've been going for a while. Which is a mistake on my part. Alright, try this. If he gets 30 mil, I'll just keep the score. If not, we'll finish off of uh, Celebration Rico. Chun, 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 chun. 
This cooldown is actually aren't too bad. It does not seem like we're hitting him, though. It's concerning. Is, a, is there a chance we're too short? Okay, we're at 10 mil at uh, 120, which I think is a good sign. Man, his shield just lasts forever, huh? Kind of makes me regret not, like, maxing out, like, S Class Hunter or X. But I still hate charge characters, so... Oh, I think he can hit 30, then. We're doing pretty good. He's got 50 seconds left. So, for his second skill, the, the slash up, you should wait for... I think you need to wait for him to, like, land a little bit to, like, maximize the damage. Like, uh, how, uh, Celebration Rico has the same problem. Otherwise, you just can't miss it. Twenty six. He literally had the other DNAs or even his like unlock skill. I think he could hit thirty mil easily because that's just so twenty damage for the entire fight. So we we'll hit that like way earlier. All right, that's enough of that. Let's finish this off with Celebration Rico. And her DNAs are not ideal. She does have the crit damage boost and the defense down. But everything else isn't like super optimal. And I don't think she has like a good main skill either. She's like extremely defensive for some reason. Alrighty, let's finish this off. What could be the final raid? See, Rico's a little tricky because she has to wait for the cooldown for the for her skills along with the decimator, and you can't use her skills during the decimator because that just screws everything up. So I pretty much just, so my cycle is just to use up all the ammo. Switch to the anchor, use her skills then, and switch back. And that hopefully gets the cooldown down fast enough.
The other thing, when you just stick on the gun, you run into the problem where you don't have enough ammo, or you accidentally shoot during the uh, cooldown. Yeah, this does so much damage. Yeah, and we're done. Easy peasy. Yeah, that machine gun. I'm pretty sure it's the strongest weapon in the game. It just melts targets. And with that, I've got the clean sweep. I thought you next ar armor. You suck. But yeah. Something really satisfying about that. <laughs> uh. So yeah, my goal was to like get the guild to like top 20. Looks like... If we're lucky, we hit top 10. Really kind of depends on who's left in the skilled. And I would appreciate anyone, you know, could help me with that. Who is, like, acti actively contributing? Because we had the problem, like, with this for, like, all the other raids. Yeah. Yeah, they donate. They don't help with the raid, though. Which I appreciate. Yeah, a lot of people just kind of did the free roll and just dipped, I guess. Uh, that's fair enough. Dying game doesn't really help much with the uh, motivation. Well, on the bright side, since I don't need to worry about the monthly activity anymore, I don't need to do co-op or story to fill out my uh, monthly activity stuff. Also because I'm done that, but still. Don't know why I didn't unlock the upper reward, though. Because it's rude of them. But let's end it looking at how cute Rico is. Ugh... I'm still having fun. Just unga boongy my way to victory. Always fun in my books. But that's all it is it is for today. So thank you everyone who joined me today. And I will see you all next time. Bye bye.